forgotten and apparently forgotten. A Chesapeake teen who committed suicide is not named in his school yearbook. Now his father and friends want to know if the school omitted him on purpose. Ten of your side's Ann McNamara spoke to them today. Ann. You usually would learn of Ethan Schumacher's death since we have a general policy against covering suicides. But in this case, the family is speaking out because Schumacher was a sophomore at Hickory High School. When he died in December, school administrators came to his funeral. They promised his single father he had their support. But the school never asked him if he wanted Ethan's name in the yearbook. And when copies of that book came out last week, his father was shocked to find Ethan wasn't mentioned at all. You can look at two pictures and you know he's supposed to be right in between those two people and he's not there. Between the last names Schools and Scott, Schumacher is missing. It's not in the index either. You won't find Ethan on the page for his JV football team. No evidence he was ever a Hickory Hawk or even existed. You don't have to do anything special. I'm not asking for a memorial, no bells and whistles. I don't need a hall named after him, but put his name where it's supposed to be. Ethan's father, David Schumacher, believes his son's name was omitted from the yearbook intentionally because of the way he died. Ethan took his own life. There's nothing that, um, nothing feels like when they're never coming back. The omission brings back the emotions from that December day. Dad calls it a dishonor, a disappointment. He went to the Hickory High School principal for answers. She told him they didn't have Ethan's picture on file because he wasn't at school when the pictures were taken. It's just a tragedy on top of a tragedy when we could have been using this as a way to educate and prevent. I don't think we've counted them all up yet. Ethan's friends started a petition to raise awareness. They have 200 signatures and growing. These last few days, they wore homemade shirts in the Hickory Halls to put in writing. Ethan Schumacher will not be forgotten. And I feel like it doesn't matter like the way you died. It's the fact that he did die and it's still a lost life and he should still be honored for it. Interesting note here, we looked through the yearbook, we found there are pictures where children were not in the picture, but their names were listed, and next to their names it said, not pictured. We wanted to know if that was a coincidence, so we called the school spokesperson who told us he could not address specific students' names, but he said no one was intentionally left out of the yearbook. I'm Ann McNamara, 10 on your side.